guys! Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, hello, how are you? I am Kara. I like talking about makeup, beauty, and skincare in my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be trying out the new Strokes Beauty Lab Eye Paint Duo. I have it in two shades, um, Purple Luster and as well as Midnight Galaxy. So aside from doing beauty reviews of makeup and skincare from local or international brands here in my channel, I also like to talk about my relationship with beauty products. You know, I'm really trying my best to not go overboard in spending. I try to be more conscious here. I try to play around with my makeup, do shop my stashes, project pans, and all of those stuff just so that I could curb my spending when it comes to beauty products so ayon if you're into that type of content please do subscribe to my channel as well as clicking on the notification bell right beside it so that you get notified whenever i make new videos now let's get started i'm super excited for this video today guys because finally there's a brand that released a product that i'm really interested in it's an eyeshadow, liquid eyeshadow. So this one came from Strokes Beauty Lab. As usual, I'm going to be testing these products out for you guys to see kung ano yung applications, yung formula niya, how, the, how is it going. I'm not sure if I can do a wear test today because when I'm filming this, hapon na. And I don't think I have enough time for like 8 hours or so to do a wear test. You know, matagal na yun sobra and sobrang late na yun. And... I would be very inclined to take a bath at that hour of the day. When I bought this, it's around 328 pesos on Strokes Beauty Lab website. The shipping fee is atrociously expensive. Um, I wish I waited for a day because they became available sa Shopee at the same introductory price of 328 pesos. But the regular price niya guys is 428 pesos. I'm not sure sa Lazada. But uh, don't worry about the product links because I'll put them all down below for you guys so that you can check it out. So they are affiliated links. You're not gonna pay extra naman there and just get a small commission if you do use my links. If you're not comfortable with using affiliate links, that's okay. It's just there for your convenience. Let's talk about the product first. So I already mentioned that they have six shades. These are the two colorful ones that I got. Purple Luster one and the Midnight Galaxy one. The other four ones are kind of on the neutral side. Ibaiba lang under. Tones. I'm also interested dun sa Desert Flare, yung hazelnut brown nila na shade. I just opted for these two na lang muna to test it out. Sabi daw dito, it's a liquid eyeshadow with two sides as you can see. One with a matte, creamy matte shade and the other one's like a sheer shimmer. Two shades siya, dual ended, dalawang component siya, which I think is pretty handy. It's crease proof, waterproof, and lost, long lasting. Uh, formulated daw with vitamin E which nourishes, nourishes the skin with every vivid stroke. So these products contain 7 grams of product. Alam ko konti lang siya but it's your eyes. So, konti nga lang yan. Pero konti lang naman din kailangan. Matagal mong maubos yan. And it says here that it's designed in California, made in Taiwan with responsibly sourced global ingredients. It's just, which is the same thing that they said dun sa Silk Kiss collection nila. I'm not sure with the other products, but I'm pretty sure that they are like that din. Let's go first with the swatches of the product before I try it on with my eyes. So, this one is Purple Luster. And it says here that it's a lush lavender shade. Ito yung doe foot niya, guys. It's my favorite doe foot. Alright. So far, sobrang dali lang na pag swatch niya. It's very pigmented and it's not streaky. Yeah, so that's purple luster, guys. Medyo pinky purple shade. Lavender nga siya. Really, really pretty. Walang streakiness or whatever. As in, one swipe lang talaga is good enough. And then this one is the other side. This is the metallic one. Uh, medyo tight lang siya. Yung doe foot niya. It's the same, but um, it's just bendy. I don't think you can see it. Oh, come on. Yeah, and there. Do you see how that bends? It's really bendy. So this is the other side. It's quite bendy, pero mas stiff siya. I could really tell that it's a lot stiffer. And I'm just going to swatch that here in one. Not gonna lie, it's really pretty. Ganda ng pagka shift niya, no? Parang deep purple shade. Tapos it has a light lilac uh, shimmer. So parang may duochrome effect siya. 
So I'm just trying to close this. Okay. I saw kasi my friend Jean Tan Ransom's page. And ang hirap daw ibalik. Lalo na dun sa shimmer na side. I think it's because of the doe foot. It's really flexible. Pinapasok mo siya sa loob. Sobrang sakto lang siya. But I understand why it would be sakto like it's tight like that. Because, syempre, you don't want the product to dry out, di ba? Let's try this one from Midnight Galaxy. And this one, they say na it's a galactic still gray. Ito yung nakakatakot. Kasi, guys, hindi talaga ako mahilig sa dark and gray shades. I like colorful shades at hindi ako yung into metallic so okay this is the wow look at that pigment one swipe lang talaga guys nakakatakot talaga gamitin wow it's so smooth kinakabahan na ako guys <laughs> not gonna lie okay so here we go this is the metallic side wow oh my gosh ang ganda ng pagka Ang ganda! It's so pigmented, smooth, and you know, it's not streaky, which I like. Ang ganda! So, I am super duper excited to try this out on my eyes now. I'm not really sure kung anong gagawin ko. Hindi ko rin alam kung maganda siya, guys. Okay, I'm just visualizing it. I'm not really sure how it is. So, I'm just gonna do a halo eye using this one. Itong purple luster will be in my inner corner. So, I have my full face on na I used the rosy tone color and then yung sa lips ko I used Penny from Dear Self Beauty and as well as yung uh, Silk Kiss nila, yung Misty Amethyst. Ayan, para something cool tone to match with the purple. Ayan, I'll zoom you guys in para kita nyo yung mata ko. And I will be using a brush on one side. And then on the other side, I will be using my fingers, or I'll just use both. I'll just use a combination of both, I think. Oh my gosh, it's so dark! I'm just going to do it here, like little by little down, and I'm gonna use my fingers to wipe it. Oh my gosh, it's so dark. But it's easy blend, as you can see. I just need so, so little. Yan, mukha siyang, mukha kong panda right now. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, madali lang siyang i-blend ha. Pero you can really tell na it's already setting on your hand. So you have to move a little quickly. Um, In my opinion. Because right now, it's already setting. And hindi naman naging messy yung fingers ko guys. Like... I'm amazed that it's not messy, which is good. Because usually, diwa, I don't like using my finger sometimes. So I'm now going to use a brush to buff those edges and try to blend it out and blend into my skin further. So yeah, it's a patchy, lang siya, but let's try it out. You know, let's build it. Let's be patient. Kasi ayoko rin naman ng super pigmented. Tapos hindi ko alam kung paano gamitin yung product. You know. Using a brush to blend it out. And then I can just add stuff. Nag-rub off siya by the way. When I'm using my brush. But that's okay. Kasi I'm just going to rub it lang ganyan. So I think that's okay. Medyo maganda naman yung pagka-smoke out niya. Although medyo patchy siya when I uh, rubbed it with my little brush. So let's try it out again. And this time with my inner corner, I think it's just dot lang talaga. Konting, konti lang. Now I'm gonna use my brush to blend this one out. I think it's a lot better with the brush. Kasi mas precise ka, lalo na with a dark color like this. Pag yung nude yung gamit ko, I'm just gonna ganun ganun lang, pucho pucho. Hindi na ako masadong Ano, um, careful, no? Kasi with the dark shades, kasi mahalat may kita mo talaga na kung saan nag start and end. So, I need to be careful lang. But so far, I love it. O, diba? Ang ganda. Ganda nyo. Oh my gosh. Before I move dun sa center of my lid, dun sa shimmer, ayoko naman din na super precise and all that stuff. Tsaka, tika mo yung hands ko. It's so clean! Diba? Pag, the, the thing that I don't like to use with cream shadows minsan is 
how messy it can get. Like, it goes everywhere. Alam mo yun? It goes everywhere. So, I just put yung matte shade here. And then, I'm gonna use a brush to apply it on my inner corner. So, I'm just gonna use this, this brush. I'll apply it on my inner corner. To see how it goes. And then, blend it na lang siguro. Mag-blend sila yan. Medyo nag-muddy siya, but that's okay. Okay lang. Don't panic! Don't panic! Just adding a little by little. Doon lang sa kamay ko. Para hindi mag-dry yung product dun sa loob ng tube. Para mas controlled. So, I'm just adding more para mas mag-pop yung lavender. Yun yung gusto ko eh. Mag-pop yung lavender. And then here, okay lang na nag-mix sila. Because that's okay with me. I'm just adding it here. I'm gonna do also like yung black dun sa lower lash line ko. And then I'm just going to blend these two together with my finger. Pricing, hindi naman ako nagsa struggle masyado. And tinatanch ko pa kasi talaga kung paano yung black, yung purple, ganun. Little by little lang guys, huwag nyo mamadaliin. Especially with dark colors, huwag nyo mamadaliin. Ay ah. yes, sir. Just adding a little bit there. Para bumalik yung darkness niya. And then I'm just going to blend the two as they meet with my brush. Like, hindi ko rub I'm just going to tap them together. Mmm! So far, so good! I love it! Okay. I'm just going to use my brush to do my lower lash line. Starting from the outer corner kasi gusto ko doon mas pigmented yung black. And then I'm spreading it out. Yan. I'm so excited. I want to see the final look already. But I just want to build it up. By the way, guys, if you want to know what brush I'm using, I'm using uh, Sigma brush E45. Yung tapered blending brush nila. Ganyan. It's pointed like this. Ganyan yung brush na ginagamit ko. Para uh, I can go through the lower lash line rin without having any problems. You know, para hindi lang sobrang blown out and mas makontrol ko siya. But that's the eye so far. I love it! Okay, and I want to use the steel shade in the middle. Yummy! Ganda! Okay, I'm, I put this I put this here sa, ano, sa hand ko muna. And ito na naman yung mahirap siyang ipasok. There you have it, guys. Ah, oh, ganda! I'm seeing that it's starting to lift the shade a little bit. Like the center of my eyelids. Yan. Just making sure that I'm packing it on. But it's not high shine masyado, no? Would you say? I don't think it's super duper high shine. Kind of underwhelmed doon sa shimmer. Kasi parang ang ganda ng shimmer dito, di ba? Like, pack! Sabi ito parang, hmm. Kulang, parang may kulang. The way for me to add, at least yung plan of attack of how I'm going to uh, create a really, really high shine shimmer, like this one. Yan, I'm going to put the doe foot, the apply ko yung shimmer mismo sa eye ko, focusing on the center of my eyelids, and then I'm gonna blend the edges using this brush. So, I hope na hindi siya mag patchy or mag lift yung shimmers, kasi sayang. Oh, wow. That looks so good on the eyes. Yan, ganyan siya. Yan, nakita ko na yung shimmer. I just need to put the wand there. And then, I'm just going to blend it with my brush. Without touching yung, ano, yung center of my eyelids. Kasi gusto ko talaga ng super shiny. Ooh, I love it. Ganda. Okay. I think, I think ganun siya talaga gawin. For the inner corner, I'm going to use this one. I'm going to put it on my eyes straight. Para mas high impact ng shine niya. I'm just gonna put it here. And then I'm gonna blend it with a brush. Uh, <laughs> okay. Close, close. Yan. I love the eye look. Oh my gosh. Guys, I just wanna tell you. I noticed that the eye look is 
getting patchy on the center. Maybe it's because I put too much or parang nag crease siya slight. I don't know if you can see that. But so far, I like nga ganito siya. Blown out, kasi hindi siya super blended. Alam mo yun, okay na to sa akin. Yan, I put more shimmers na lang sa eyes ko. Oops. Grabe, ang hirap talaga ipasok. Ah! Ganyan siya, guys. I'm just gonna wait for it to dry before I close my eyes para hindi siya sobrang mag-migrate, you know? So, while that is drying, I'm going to put my gel eyeliner dito sa lower lash line ko. And I'm wearing Amethyst Hour from Colourpop. Yan na yung eye ko. Yan. Pak! Ganda! Talagang, oh, nag mas naging cohesive siya tuloy. I love it! Ganyan siya. Okay, and now I'm gonna do the other eye. Okay, guys. So, this is the eye look done with lashes on. Um, I tried to blend it out as much as I can. So, so this is eye look on. What do you think? I think it looks pretty nice. Ang ganda lang ng pagka pop ng purple dun sa inner corner ko. I love the black look. Alam mo yun. Parang ang ganda ng pagka blend lang nila together. Okay, so I want to tell you my first impressions with this product. Of course, syempre ginamit ka lang sa the first time. Now, I can't really fully say whether I like it or not. But so far, I'm okay. I, I like it. I've not tried anything like this to compare this with. It's my first time using liquid eyeshadows in general. So, for me, yung product na napansin ko, um, it's really, really easy to blend kapag basa pa siya. That's when you really have to blend. And then it sets right away. Medyo mabilis siya mag-set, guys. Um, uh, for me kasi, medyo nahirapan ako. I'm not gonna lie. Nas Nag-struggle ako, especially dito sa color na to. Si Midnight Galaxy. And I think it's because of just the color itself. You know, it's super dark and malaki yung contrast nito. So I can't just spread it ng ganun ganun lang. Not like mga neutral shades na madali lang. Na it would just blend so easily together. Kasi neutral nga siya. Medyo malapit siya dun sa skin tone ko. Mal mal malaki kasi yung contrast. Sobrang dark nito, guys. As in, sobrang dark niya. It's really smoky, really dramatic yung effect. Which is something that I like. And ayun, kaya doon ako nahirapan slightly. Pero, when it terms naman dun sa purple luster, yung yung matte niya na shade, sobrang dali lang i-blend. As in, kahit na hindi ako ganun ka-careful, ayun, madali lang talaga maganda yung itsura niya. Lighter shades, neutral shades, I don't think I will have any problem. Na-realize ko rin na when I was looking at the shimmers, pag tinap mo siya ng tinap dito sa eyes, it's gonna pick up on itself kasi it likes to stick to itself. So, magiging mas sheer yung uh, pagka-shine niya. So, the best way for me when I applied the shimmer, which is trinay ko dito sa other eye, Ayan, o, trinay ko dito sa other eye is to apply it first kung saan mo yung highest shine and then I blended out the edges using a brush. So, yun yung nakita kong best way to use it. Kapag tinap mo siya ng tinap on itself, uh, it's gonna sheer out the shine. Hindi na siya ganun ka-high shine. Very sheer lang talaga siya. But if you want high impact shimmer, just do that. Yung leave it on, let it, ano, let it dry a little bit, then then blend out the edges. Pag nag-dry na to, mabilis siya mag-set, di ba? Pag nag-dry na to, dun na siyang immovable na talaga. Hindi, hindi mo siya magagalaw. Like, ayan, tignan nyo. Hindi na siya magagalaw. Except though, yung shimmer, pag nirub mo siya ng nirub, mag-wear off siya. Hindi na siya ganun ka-high shine, no? Di ba? Tignan nyo. Hindi na siya ganun ka-high shine. Kasi I think that's how it is lang talaga. Nandyan pa rin siya, pero yung shininess niya, yung shift of colors, parang nag-fade slight. That's, I think, how it'll turn out. Pero nandiyan pa rin siya. It's still there. So, if we investigate on my eyes right now, slightly may parang creasing siya dito kasi the product likes to stick to itself nga. Ayan, dito parang mas better. Pero pag tinignan mo siya straight sa eyes mo, right? Ayan, no? Hindi naman siya ganun kahalata na nagkikrease. Pag pinikit mo lang yung mata mo, doon mo lang makikita. Hindi ka naman kumakusap sa tao na nakapikit, di ba? Unless you're playing a game or something, I don't know. Basta parang kahit ganyan lang yung itsura, okay lang. 
So, doon sa edges na itong Midnight Galaxy, since nahirapan akong i-blend out siya kasi nag-set na siya, ang ginawa ko, kumuha ko ng sponge, nilagyan ko ng konting concealer, tapos I tap lightly on the edges where needed more help on in blending. And so far, ganun, maganda naman siya. Ayan, ang ganda lang ng kulay, diba? Tignan mo si Purple Luster dito sa matte side. Kahit ginanon ko lang siya, nothing, no problem at all. Pero kasi with the Midnight Galaxy, it's just really dark. That's why I need to be careful. Kasi mas obvious na hindi mo na-blend ng maayos. Parang ganon. Overall, I like the products. I like the products. The doe foot on the matte side is more stiffer than the doe foot on the shimmer side. Kaya dahil sobrang soft niya, parang <laughs> nag-bend siya. Nahihirapan ka. Kailangan lang sobrang sakto. I think it's... Maganda. Like, I am super interested to try Desert Flare. Like, the lightest of the shade. Like, gusto ko yun. And even Plum Prism then as well. It's not perfect, but I like it. I'm just really happy that they released something that's not... That has nothing to do with neutral looks, everyday looks. I like that they released something like this. Na my purple that you can play around with. Na meron din something like this na for more dramatic looks. Alam mo, hindi lang siya yung multi-use, everyday, you know, makeup look kind of product. Na medyo marami na rin kasing ganun. So, I'm just happy that they released, you know, with their product photos. So, parang something edgy, something that's editorial, something that's, you know, fashionable, not sort of the everyday type of look makeup thing yung peg nila. Which I'm happy about, because at least it's I don't know, it's just more adventurous in my opinion. And mas na attract talaga ako doon sa type of um, visuals. Um, I wish that they release more shades. I'm really interested to see that they release more shades with this one. Bangan, I like it. I really like it. I'm super excited for this launch, and I'm happy about it. I know it's not perfect, but I really like it. Um, I wouldn't recommend. Midnight Galaxy for beginners just because of the color itself. Medyo mahirap siyang gamitin. But yung purple luster, I like it. I really like magandang shade. Magandang shade niya. I'm happy with both of these. So guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a like if you do like it. And ayun, let me know if you have further questions down below. What do you think about this collection overall? Do you agree with me? Disagree with me? Let me know down below in the comments. Ayan, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I hope to see you in my next one. Bye-bye!